is doing its best to help out communities, not just students. The district is partnering with the city of Little Rock to help strengthen neighborhoods by creating what they're calling community hubs. They're called community schools, and if you take a look at your screen, you'll see where they'll be. And as Jay Burr reports, the hubs will provide much-needed services that in the long run will make the community stronger and healthier. The Little Rock School District is extending its reach to just beyond the classroom as it is now partnering with the city of Little Rock to help improve the communities that their schools are in. The Little Rock School District has identified four schools as community schools. Little Rock Chief Educational Officer Jay Bart says there's more to this than just turning around test scores. We need to do what we can to uh, improve the quality of life in the neighborhood around community schools so that uh, the, the neighborhood itself can be a healthier uh, place for kids to grow up in. These schools, which happen to all be south of I-630, will serve as hubs for the district and the city to help provide services to those who live in that area, such as digital literacy and English-speaking classes. But we also know that uh, that students need um, need additional supports to really uh, uh, to really thrive. Carla Coleman has volunteered through her church for 11 years at Watson Elementary, and she thinks this will start a rally for people and organizations across the city. If you are in a community, you're going to want to help each other, and I, I see this as a really great thing. Her church provides students at Watson with two uniforms at the beginning of the year. They also provide Christmas gifts to every student and their siblings, and that's on top of providing shoes, socks, and any other needs that arise. And it makes it all worthwhile you leave there, you know, knowing that you did the right thing for the right people. Barth says that's what this system is meant to do, provide those community partnerships to help those who need it, especially those needs beyond reading, writing, and arithmetic. The challenges facing the neighborhoods around these schools uh, didn't happen overnight, and therefore we need to think about um, uh, improving uh, the quality of life for, for everyone uh, around that, those neighborhoods. So students can really come of age in healthier places to live. Also, LRSD will be conducting surveys in those areas, and they want to hear from students, parents, and those in the community, regardless of your affiliation with the specific school in your area, and they will then go about addressing the most pressing needs that come from that. Back to you.